everyone welcome back to ask nutritionist deepa's quick easy flavorful recipe videos and today i'm going to show you how to make a oil free salad dressing now many of you may have received or have seen my salad dressing flow chart because i get this question all the time hey deepa if you want us to cut down on oil and wants to eat uh, and want us to eat vegetables then how do we make oil free salad dressing and this is another template salad dressing recipe and you can change the ingredients but i'm going to show you what are the basic components of making a oil free salad dressing recipe and why oil is not needed so the ingredients are you start with the citrus in this case it's balsamic vinegar couple tablespoons of balsamic vinegar half of that would be any kind of sweetener so in this case i have fig juice because i do product development so i get samples and somebody gave me a fig juice concentrate you can use date syrup you can use molasses you can use maple syrup depending on your dietary preferences if you are sos which means salt oil sugar free then you can just use some fruit puree real fruit and then followed by a base of dijon mustard so you start with the citrus then some sweetener and then the base of uh, mustard or tahini or hummus okay as far as the flavoring to go with it it's up to you you can add some smoked paprika garlic and herbs are always the easy error proof flavors to go to so i'm just going to put all these ingredients in this bottle and whisk everything together and that's how we are going to create a oil free salad dressing now as you can see i have done my blend in here of vinegar fig juice concentrate mustard and some herbs and i decided to add some cayenne because i like it spicy no surprise there and some garlic powder and i'm just going to whisk this away now the reason that we do not need oil in this salad dressing is oil is the highest caloric component in terms of calories among all the food additives okay and 4000 calories per pound it is inflammatory we get oil by extracting and using chemicals rather using chemicals during extraction it causes inflammation adds calories so if you are eating a low calorie salad or a low calorie vegetable or a starch why do you want to increase the calorie density by adding oil and think where the oil is coming from the oil comes from whole foods so in this case we don't need extra oil because mustard is going to act as a emulsion factor there is enough oil in mustard remember there is mustard oil so there is mustard oil which means the whole mustard is going to have oil so that's pretty much it that's how i keep my salad dressings ready and you can use them on on a salad on avocado toast warm salads bowls what have you so this little meal prep so having such things handy is a crucial part of the meal prepping every day you don't want to spend time making salad dressings i usually keep 3 4 salad dressings handy now and use it later now this is a time if you feel that it needs flavor adjustments this is where you are going to do it okay mine tastes pretty good it's tangy spicy sweet it's going to go on a beautiful salad what more do i want okay thanks for watching and send me those questions comments and i'll see you next time